In this episode, we are exploring an old abandoned mansion slash castle. Guys, look at this thing. This is crazy. The owners of this castle are saying this place is haunted, but online I read otherwise. I, I heard mixed reviews that this place is not haunted. It's an old castle that looks haunted, but they're trying to be haunted and it's not haunted. I don't really know. So in this video, we're going to uncover the truth about this place. Colonel. Thank you. Thank you, Colonel. Guys, we're doing this EVP one more time for you guys on a loudspeaker. I better say you not. I heard once. <laughs> not twice, though, so we know it's you. One more guys. time. I heard once. Oh not my twice, god! Guys. So clear. Pool table, um, we did have a death that occurred around this area, and it was the maintenance man right in the 1990s. Is. His name was Richard Dickey, we called him. And he died right in front of Denise cleaning on that banister. No way. Yes. We actually think he's still here. The communications with the flashlights, I mean, we were communicating with Dick Edinger and Colonel Wilson for like 45 minutes. So, so, in this, what's going on in this picture? This girl worked for the Halloween events many, many years ago. This is actually a mirror that is projecting back. That guy. Yeah, that guy is very unexplainable. Yo, who is that guy? And this is the same mirror, same room. This was just a couple years ago. And this woman in the background Bro! wasn't there. We believe that she's actually wearing the dress that is in the closet, is right? In the closet. Since the 1970s, different tourists coming here have described seeing a woman looking out these windows. Okay. They're leaving. The owners are leaving with the house to ourselves. Now you guys know the history of the place. You know we're in this crazy, like, renaissance, creepy uh, castle mansion. You gotta watch part two if you wanna see what happens. We're gonna be here the whole night. So yo, 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 what a way to start part two. This thing is literally going red right in front of us. And, oh, shit, it's gone. Oh my Wait. god. Wait. Wait, it's going off again. The EMF meter is going off like crazy. Dude, this is, that's, I actually never seen it went off before. It's gone. Okay, too. Yo. Yo. I knew, yo, that's crazy. We, when we try using it in our video, did we ever like add it in because it was so like whack? That yeah, there was, nothing it? happened. Well, I'm, wait. <laughs> She's like, what? Yeah. <laughs> Where is it? Where is it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to see. Where? It don't do it no more. That Leave means it that means it's gone, no, dude. dude. It's a freaking ghost here. That's what it really means. He likes me. <laughs> Wait, dude, there's. <laughs> Wait, what was that? All right, guys, so obviously Iz already caught some crazy stuff and it's somewhat, look at that, it's orange. It, it keeps messing, unless it's like our gear, it could be our gear, but not, nah, see, it's not really, uh, dude, I don't know, that's sick. But we're just starting it off now as they leave. We're gonna take our stuff and bring it upstairs. We're gonna start up there. Well, John's pretty much leading it. We're just, yo, John knows what he's doing. Right, gonna we're just gonna that. follow that. Yeah, let's follow John. <laughs> this is nice. It's definitely a better, that's like a different feeling up here than down there. No, it really is though. It, it is. really does feel like the, the vibe's a lot different here. All right, so we are going into the supposedly most active room in the house, Facts. right off the bat. This is, this is grandma's bedroom. Hey grandma, I should help. <laughs> Dude, I tell you what, if you get that freaking doll to beat, cause that's technically a REM pod, but as a doll, yeah. stuffed animal form, if that goes off, I'm been, telling you, like, let's look, let's get it. It has been is, is that a pain in the Yeah, it's actually not beeping today. You have to have, like, energy near it, like... All right, so we're in here, we're setting up. Josh is gonna set up his camera over here, get you that wide-angle view. John brought our friend Alf. 
who is basically a REM pod that we as humans cannot set off like a regular REM pod, like the one Josh has in his hand right now. You can set that off with your hand. Like Remember, so. Remember, if this goes off, guys, you guys already know I'm gonna flip out. <laughs> All right, we're gonna put it next to the door. We're starting off hard. We're starting off, usually we'll start off slow, but we're going right up into it with John. He wants to go hard. So Josh is putting his REM pod right there, right, just in case anything comes in. It'll beep like so. And oh yeah, yeah, good go live. Is that a bad? Thing? Yeah, no worries. Nah, go live. That's cool. That's super cool. Oh, oh, that's not fake. That's yo, that's real. You have to actually touch that. I want to get the door. Okay, look at how far. Look, stop. Hold up. Look how far away we are from that thing. We can't be faking that right now, dude. That means they're here. Yeah. They're literally here right now. You have to touch that. They're literally here. It's it's probably just like chilling in the room with us right now. Dude, it really is. But who, who is it? Hi, Bunny. Yeah, she was talking about Bunny when I went out. I can't remember what her, I always call her Bunny and I always forget what her real name was. Blossom. Blossom, I'm sorry. That was a solid REM pod hit. Yeah, that was a good like we five just seconds. Started. Yeah. This house might be, might be way more hot. This could just be one of those nights. Yeah. Dude, because think about it, for an example, we would have to go up to it. Yeah, think, touch it. <laughs> you have to actually see? touch that thing. It'll shut up in a second, yeah. Think about that. Mm. So it actually did exactly what you just did, because it stayed on like the same way. Yeah. Are you still here? <gasps> Yo, that's crazy. Who are you? Can you tell me your name if you're in this room? Nah, I don't. I don't know about that. Well, no on the. Yes. Yeah. Can you say it again? He just said it again. If you're the colonel, can you say colonel? Flat out, no. Is it Colonel Wilson? If it is, we say Wilson. Colonel Wilson, if you hear it, can you please come talk to us? Colonel, if you're here, can you come kind of say Colonel? <laughs> Colonel, thank you. Thank you, Colonel. What's your last name, Colonel? Uh Can you say it again louder? What's your last name? Colonel what? Wilson. It said it again. I have it on video. Colonel, Colonel Wilson, thank you for talking to us. You can say whatever you'd like, Colonel. Are you still here? Dead. Sorry, you're dead. Who else is with you, Colonel? Huh? 
How many spirits are with you, Colonel? I heard one or four. Can you say it one more time? How many are with you, sir? Twelve. Twelve again. Yeah. You heard twelve? I, heard I just heard times. twelve, yeah. How about Blossom? Blossom, are you here? Of course. Well, of course. Yeah. Well, of course, I yes. Heard, of course. Hi, Blossom. I think she said hi. She said hi. Blossom, can you come say hello? Can you come talk to us? I know it's hard. Can you say Blossom if you're here? What did she say? Blossom. Hey, I, it is said Blossom or something, but either way I heard... She said Blossom. Did she? She read I mean, very clearly. It, it sounded said. like it. I think I'm losing my hearing sometimes. No, no, like... I always it, have to listen to a playback and then I'll hear it. I think it said it. It was a little distorted, but I, I think... She, I heard some I at the end. Blossom. Yeah. I didn't hear it distorted at all. It was very clear. Blossom. I she probably has like the best ears out of us all. I don't know. I mean... Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I, I have this whole footage, yeah. so we're gonna be able to see it. So you can play it back to hear like all kinds of things. But yeah, that's what usually yeah, that's what usually happens. So we are now in the colonel's room. Yeah. Got a couple of things set up. Right here, we have one of these REM pods set up on the big fireplace. We have another REM pod set up right over there where Josh is walking in. John, remind me what this thing is called right here. It's a REM pod. Oh, okay. But so it's kind of like. Tilt it a little bit so that way it'll, if you touch stuff, it'll go off. Yeah. Oh, all right. Okay, cool. So we got three REM pods. We have our EMF reader. We're going to do another spirit box session in here as well. I'll try a quick uh, a EVP session too. And an EVP well, we, session. Are nice. Yes, I love those. Yeah. I, we lack those on our channel. Yeah, we, we have do. We start doing those more. We do, for sure. I thought I heard you talk, but really low. Could you please come up to this orange light and talk in it to it slowly and clearly? knock on something so we know you're in here. Oh, thank you. twice. I heard once. Can you not twice though? So we know it's you. He really said no. No. Way. no. Oh my god. No fing way. You hear it? Not twice though, so I know it's you. What was before this? I heard once. <laughs> That's our first ever EVP. Yeah. No. That's freaky. Yeah. Dude, the ghost just straight up said no. I heard once. No. Not twice okay. though. Oh my, oh my god! Yeah. It's the craziest whisper, like, no, 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 no. And you can almost hear like that. And the snack. crazy thing is, and what's, what's good about the EVP is, Seth is recording live. So you know we're not faking it. You know what I mean? And you yeah. go back and look and make sure nobody's talking to you. And make a noise if you're here with us right now. Who the f*** 
What's that? What did you hear? A real tap. Like a it behind Seth. Like, yeah, like behind it. Seth. Because I kind of yawned when it happened. <laughs> Dude, we all heard that. If you want us to leave the room, just yell leave into that voice recorder on the bed. Yeah, yeah see? Hear that. See? What is it? Yeah. Clear as day. And then you see me swear right after. I'm like, what? <laughs> yeah, I was freaked out. Seth, man. You're always attracting ghosts, bro. I don't know what it is. That's scary, because I was behind you. And I'm the one that invited him into the room. You did. If you want us to leave the room, just yell yeah, leave into that voice recorder on the bed. Once. <laughs> oh my <laughs> gosh. No yeah. Let's play it one more time. Hang on. Guys, we're doing this EVP one more time for you guys on a loudspeaker. Ever so you know. I heard once. Can you not <laughs> twice <laughs> though, so we know it's you. One more yes. time. I heard once. Oh my god! Guys, so clear. Guys, guys, god. Listen, we're, rec we're, we're replaying this live so that you can actually understand that we're not like faking it in post-production. Like this is, this is a real recording and we're listening to it right now. We actually heard that. It's so cool. That was great. <laughs> It just freaks us out so I just want to keep hearing it because it's so real. It's so real. No. Yeah. No. <laughs> so cool. It's so freaky cool. as hell. Alright, here we go. We're going yeah, back upstairs. Guys. You say, you say it again if you need help. Say help. SLS camera right now, which we've only ever used once in part three of Conjuring House. There's a lot going on. There's a lit, just a lot of activity in general here. Yeah, we're gonna set it up. You wanna explain to the viewers how this, how this kind of even works? Um, it's like a connect, but it, instead of like um, reading your body movements as you're playing like a video game, it projects like opposite way. So it's gonna pick up anything in front of it that's uh, like a body or shape or figure that basically you can't see. Um, so you use it to pick up um, figures uh, that you can't see and it maps it out as a stick. Right, stick so it draws like a stick figure and that's the figure. Let's show them. All right, here's an example. It's mapping out that as a person standing behind the stick. Yeah, you can see the stick figure yeah. and it's trying to say that is a person. So it obviously works great. See? Yeah. It's mapping it out. That's pretty neat. Yeah, it works well. So we're gonna just walk around, see if we can actually find some oh. people. Oh, pick it up again. I was like, oh. Yeah, let's try it down here real quick. It's got to be something in here. <laughs> you would think because it's a big room, but maybe not. They could just be chilling upstairs. Oh, there was, some, there was something. Yep, I caught it. Nothing it's yet. Gone now. Yeah, it flew away. It was like right there. Yeah, I mean, worst case is it was detecting something that wasn't there, but was pretty neat. 
I've gotten something on that couch right there. Oh, oh my God. Oh, dude. Because of that, no? See, it's like above whatever that, above the statue. I wonder how legit this is. I don't know. It's like the top of the painting. Whoa. I mean, they're detecting something. Now it's floating. Now it's back. Now it's detecting that. Yeah. It's really, it's a really hit and miss. If you're in this room, and you stand up to somebody at the table. Dude. Someone's at the just... chair. It's in the chair itself. Dude, someone's literally in the. Oh my god, no, dude, that's no joke. Like I just shined it on there before and it wasn't there. Someone's sitting at the dinner table as we speak. I'm not even kidding. It almost looks like it's eating, like. Like it's sitting there. Dude. And hands are on the table. And I, I have Yo. it shining that way too. Yo, dude, like. John, this is f***ed up. Oh, it left the it table. It just left the table. Oh, no. no it's back. Guys, you want to see this right now. All right, so Seth is now standing next to him. Where is Seth? I don't even see Seth on the camera. Oh, it's see? Seth up, no. But see, now it picks up Seth. Just to show you how legit this works. Alright, now let me leave. Oh, it's no. Oh my god. The minute it's picking you up you. It's picking up you and, and him. Where is he? In the chair, I think. Still in the chair? Yes. Yeah. And you're next to him. I'm not even. Joe, bro. This is actually really spooky. Let's see. Will it pick me up? Yeah, try going over there too. Dude, it's crazy because that's like the master chair too, so it's like no, you know what I mean? Dude, it could be freaking Colonel. Yeah, I picked her up right away. No, I don't see. Oh, there he is. Oh my god. Yeah, you got all three all of you. All three right? of you are there. Like, oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, this is. I feel colder. Yo, touch him. Yeah, touch him. He's like going crazy in that chair. Like, I don't Yo, know what he's it... doing. Oh, he's oh, gone. Seth Dude. touched him and he went away. Yeah, as soon as you touch him, he's gone. He just completely. He's gone, gone now, bro. Like, he's not being detected anymore. <laughs> the minute you. The minute you as look soon like, as you touch him. It looks like you really... touched his head and he just went poof. Bro, I'm I'm not even. Whoever's in this room, we didn't mean to disturb you. We're just excited to have your interaction. He's moving his hands, go. <laughs> Is he back? Yeah, he's back now. <laughs> I'm sorry if I bothered you. It's funny watching. Seth, it looks so weird. Yo, try moving around, and seeing if he's still there. Like, all right, let's move on this side. Like. What if you sit in the chair? No, nah, don't sit in the chair. Don't sit in the chair. I'm trying to see if this... Dude, no, nah, it's really detecting. It's really detecting him. This is great. <laughs> Dude, like, you're literally looking at him and it shows that's it. That's so weird, like, to think that someone's sitting right here and I, I can't see them. <laughs> it's not picking up her right now. I have a, a kind of an angle, too. Well, how about this? What if we go like right here? Guys, we just moved to see like, okay, could it be a glitch? But it's not. Just we just literally second. moved directions and he's still sitting in that freaking chair. I'm gonna sit next to him. Yo, do it. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Stand behind him and give him a back rub. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Dude. What? Come on. You can't fake this. Oh my god. Yo, have you ever seen something this good? It's pretty cool. <laughs> you can't, you can't explain this, dude. You are literally a. Oh my god, bro. I can't wait to look at this footage. Dude. I can't, yo, I cannot wait for you to see this footage. This is incredible footage. Yo, people are gonna flip when this when they see Seth's this. Seth's eating dinner with a spirit. I mean, Seth. Pass the biscuits. You are literally <laughs> detected and moving just as if the spirit is, as a normal. Yeah, I mean, it's no joke. He's moving with you. 
Is he? Yeah, he's waving his hand. He's waving his hand. All right, explorers, guys, like new viewers out there, come on. It detects human, like a body forms. It detected this dude, our, our night friend. Seth is sitting at the dinner table with, you know, the ghost who's sitting at the head dining spot, the table. You can't fake that. I mean, I'm mind blown. We have, we've had a lot happen in this house. And at the beginning of this video, I was like skeptic. I'm like, okay, let's debunk this or let's see. Like at first I was like, I think the owners just want money to restore their house. I'm like, they're probably gonna fake some sort of like tourist haunted thing. And I really thought that to be honest. So sorry if I offend you if you're watching this, Denise, but that's really what I thought. And honestly, there's been way so much happening that I cannot explain. It is crazy. I mean, the EVP, you, you already know. But that my light just died actually, so I'm gonna change the batteries and we're gonna keep it going. <laughs> Alright guys, all good things come to an end. We are now done this episode of Beyond the Dark. This is the Wilson Castle, and we just investigated it. And I will say that this place is 100% haunted. We had the crazy sounds, the noises, the voices from the other dimension. We had the REM pod go off. We had um, EVP, straight up voices saying no right away. Like, you can't fake it. We were recording at the same time. We have even the SLS camera going off. Seth was able to sit next to the ghost at the dining table. I mean, it is unbelievable. It has been an incredible adventure. I actually like this equally as much as The Conjuring House. So, it's been really fun. It's been great. Um, we have a set, like I said, a three and a half hour drive home. It's three in the morning. We're gonna get home at 6 a.m. I guess we should have got a hotel, but I knew about, all right, 24 hours ago, I guess, give or take, I knew I was gonna come to Vermont. I didn't, at first, I, it was just that unexpected that I was coming here. We rushed this. It is what it is, but it became a great video in the end. And like I said, guys, I think this place is 100% haunted. It, it's been great. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And tune into the next one. I am about to leave the mansion, get back in the car, and get out of here. Hopefully, we are safe and we are not cursed. Big shout out to Seth. Big shout out to John Huntington, uh, who led the investigation. Uh, his link in the description down below. So is Seth's. Check out their YouTube channel. Subscribe to them. Yeah. Yeah. You know, you know what it is, guys. I'm out of here. Whoa. We're locked in. I think we're not leaving.